Hey guys, it's Samoya here. So welcome back to another video. Now, I went to go dye my hair the other day. And if you've gone on to my Instagram, you will see some pictures of when I got it done. Um, little backstory on this is that I asked for highlights, right? And I only wanted this like royal blue color. If you can see, it's a big mess this royal blue color that's all i wanted for my hair but they didn't understand me when i went so and i at first i wanted this bluish greenish color and i said no 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 no. i want this royal blue because i feel like this would i thought that this would show a lot more than this after they had dyed it but they thought that i wanted both of them so Ta-da! This mistake turned out to be one of the nice mistakes that I've gotten so far. But this is not a video about just my hair. Um, this is a new video of another Michael Kors haul. Um, and last time I did the Michael Kors haul, which was my first one, um, it was about handbags. But this time it is a different haul because it's just a general Michael Kors haul. Um, it's not in particular a uh, specific item. Um, I bought like a couple of items that I want to share with you guys. But I've had my hair like down kind of straight almost the whole time in this channel. So I'm going to curl it and, you know, get a little bit more ready before we do this video. Okay guys, so I tried to curl my hair. My hair is very stubborn, so it doesn't really like doing much. I'm gonna try again later when hopefully um it like kind of works out, but like so far it's it's been a fail. But ah, let's get started with this haul. So the first item I do want to show you guys is these Michael Core uh track pants. Um, I am not, I never really had tramp pants before, but I like these because of all of these buttons that are right here. Um, if you like unbutton the buttons, you can see the Michael Core logo. Um, I think that's a really nice, um, little detail that they added on here, which is really nice. Um, the fabric is very soft. Um, and it's like the stretchy kind, so that's nice. And it's like wide leg, so it's whatever you wanna do. I am very short, so wide leg is like a little bit scary to wear just cause like I don't want to look a lot shorter. Um, but I think like maybe these will do me justice cause I really, really hope so. Cause I did buy wide leg um, pants from Michael Kors before and they did do me justice so i hope it's the same thing with the track pants um so these track pants um i have to look for the name because i completely forgot what they are called okay so these track pants uh, is called the logo tape button track pants and they go for 175 dollars so these are very com like I, they feel very comfy and, and inside is like 
kind of the same, almost the same material as the one that part outside, but these are very nice and they have pockets, which is what I appreciate the most because women pins nowadays don't really have pockets. Um, it's a little bit sad to see that, you know, you got to carry things like in a purse, but that's why I bought so many purses um, just to like be able to put things in my bag in because I don't have pockets. So this is the first item. Let's move on. The next item I'm going to show you guys is a jacket that goes along with the track pants or comes from the same uh, what do you call it? The same collection of the track pants. So it's this Michael Kors jacket and it's very nice. See that? Now the reason why I say it's from the same um, collection is because it also has the buttons. Um, you also see the logo and they have very similar names. So this jacket is called the Logo Tape um, anorak, I think that's what we call it. That's what it's called. Um, yeah. And this jacket runs for a hundred and ninety-five dollars. Um, and what I love about this jacket, it also has the Michael Cord logo where the collar is. It's very nice. I feel like you can wear this on a rainy day and it will still be pretty awesome. And then there's like a nice zipper. See this like cute Michael Kors zipper. Oh, it's like reflection. And then they have like weird pockets. So this pocket goes like that. Then you gotta open it and just put your stuff in here. Um, I it's like it will be something I need to get used to, but that's okay. I forgive you, Michael Kors, because you are one of my favorite brands. So this is the logo tape jacket. Let's move on to the next item. So the next item we have comes in a very cute little box. Now, I really like the Michael Kors boxes. Um, I know Gucci boxes are very nice, um, nicer quality than the Michael Kors one, but those are like the two brands I really like the boxes from. So I like this one, it's like a pop-up Michael Kors. And the Gucci one is a lot harder, but I like the design. It's, it's very cute. Now, these are something that I didn't think I would buy at all because I'm not very, you know, I'm not a big fan of slime. But I saw these and I thought, you know, why not? Like, these actually look kind of cute and why not just buy them? So these are white and navy blue Michael Kors slides um, to give you the name. They are called the Demi Logo Tape Slide Sandal. All right, um, so if we take out the other one, so these look the wrong way. <laughs> so these look like this. Um, they have the Michael Kors logo out where the heel is and the whole tape across and then look the cute thing about this is that it has a micro cord logo on the bottom as well so these slides run for $99 and these are very very soft like they feel comfortable in your hands so imagine when you wear them um and yeah I like this type of you know material like this type of um I guess you can say like plasticky touch to the tape part and their platform, like again, I am short. So platform stuffs are my best friend. So what do you guys think about these? These are very cute. I might buy another pair, but in a different color. So maybe we'll look at that later. So this is the third item to this haul. Let's move on to the next one. So the next item I'm gonna show you comes in another big Michael Kors box. And these are actually some sneakers that I've been looking at the whole time when I was like searching and looking in the Michael Kors stores. And it's like 
the one thing that keeps popping up and like telling me to buy me, buy me, buy me. Um, so they are these nice platform sneakers and they look like this. Um, so I couldn't like, once I got these, these were the first thing I had to open. So which is why you see the laces out, but I was so excited to get these. I have not worn them yet, but I just tried them on. I just wanted to see if like, oh, if I can make this whole video without having to go and return these for another size. But this is a seven and a half. Um, it looks, you know, big. It's a, it's like a different type of shoe that I wear, but it is something that I really like. So it's like leather and then suede in the front and in the back. You have the Michael Core logo here, and you also have it on the bottom of the sneaker. Now, these two do not weigh that much. Um, I actually very much like the weight on these because I do have other shoes that weigh a lot more than this, but I like this um, kind of weight. So I like some weight to stuff, like a little bit of weight makes it feel like a little bit more expensive. Um, these sneakers are called the Felicia Leather Platform Trainer. Um, and they run for $160, okay? So, and then the shiny, shiny, shiny Michael Kors inside the shoe. But what do you guys think? I fell in love with these when I saw them. I needed to get them, so I finally did. Now, this is the fourth item. Let's move on to our last and sadly final item of this haul. So, in my first Michael Kors haul, I did introduce you guys to this beautiful handbag of mine. Um, the one that I bought, it's a particular handbag that I usually don't buy, but because I fell in love with these little MKs going all over the, you know, the front side of the bag, See that? Um, and this red bag went for $198, like I said in the last video. It is red, white, and gold, so you can do it in two ways. But this was from the last haul. In this haul, I'm introducing, because I did say I was going to probably get it, but I got the black version of that red bag. And like I told you guys, like I saw this one too and I fell in love. Okay, so this one is black, white, and silver. And it's like one of those bags that I really, really, really wanted to get. Um, because I don't have much black, silver chain Michael Kors bag. They're usually in gold. So to remind you guys what the name of this bag was. Is called is called the Whitney Large Graphic Logo Convertible Shoulder Bag, and unlike the red bag that I have, which ran for a hundred and ninety eight dollars, this one ran for three hundred and twenty eight dollars. Now, black bags are usually the ones that don't go like you know get discounted a lot, but colored items do. This one, when I bought it, it was on discount for $198. However, this one, the black ones do not go on sale that often. No matter where you go, those do not. Unless you go where the Michael Kors store and all Michael Kors places that, all places that sell Michael Kors have that 25% off, but that's when Michael Kors, Mr. Michael Kors decides to give us that discount. But now I have both bags. So if you open this, it well, well, we'll start here because I kind of like my finger on that. It's very V silver. Open this, same thing. It's two pockets in the zipper in the middle. Like I said, again, you can wear this as a shoulder or as a oops, shoulder or as a crossbody, whichever one you would like to do. Um, and there both beautiful so now I have choices 
that I can pick whether I want to wear this one or this one. So let me let me know which one do you like best. You like the red one or the black one? I personally like them both, but maybe a little bit more on the black side because um, I go towards all black items before any colored items, unless they are blue. Then I'll make more the exception. But this red one caught my eye, and now I have the black one. And this was the last and final item of this haul, guys. So thank you very much for watching this video and with my new look. Um, let me know what you guys think. Do you like the blue and bluish greenish hair? I have to try to finish like curling this because my hair does not like getting curled at all. It actually hates the heat and right now it is getting hot because I tried curling it as you've seen in the beginning of this video. But, so I'm going to go now. <laughs> so if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and please comment down below if you like my Michael Kors hauls. I would like to make more in the future. And like always, please subscribe to my channel. I make new videos every Friday and I will see you all next Friday. So me and Michael Kors are out. Bye guys.